She's represented us in government. She's represented us in organizations. She's been committed to this community. And of course, we're especially proud because this is her alma mater. And there are many universities who would love to have claimed her where we were the lucky ones. We had the chance to talk and I, I was able to tell her that she was so inspiring because she shared her story with me. It was just very inspiring knowing I could still achieve what I want to achieve and do things that I want to do. Before I met her, it was a little intimidating, you know, to hear that this person who had been a legislator, mayor, uh, involved in so many different ways on campus, things like that. And then when I happened to come upon her the first time I was here after a few weeks or so, and very kind, sweet, understated in a, in a lot of ways in terms of her demeanor, and that's what I imagined uh, allowed her to get a lot of things done in her career. She always made sure that we were treated very fairly but on the other hand, she also took her responsibility to the University of Illinois in, in, in the larger sense very seriously. And one reason she was effective for us was that she gained the respect and the trust of the other trustees. And that transferred into confidence in our institution. And so she became, a, again, a highly respected, trusted member. She did those things in a very high quality manner. She does everything. Kieran's experience as a, uh, as a politician, as a community and global citizen, I think gives her a perspective that not many of us truly understand. And I think that she realizes that this can add so much more to the depth of the educational experience overall for any of our students here at UIS. We would have uh, conversations where you know, I would meet with her for lunch and or where she would uh, kind of mentor me on the different budget committees that uh, I was a part of also um, being able to give me insights on um, how decisions are, are being made. She gave me a lot of that confidence and inspired me that uh, no, no matter one's background, no matter what, what's their story, uh, they, they, they can achieve anything. In any university, when you have uh, graduates who are loyal, who want to invest in it, who believe in it, who want future generations to gain the benefits they received, you're going to get donors. And that's, I think, is, it could explain Karen as well. I applied to dental school this past summer, so and I got accepted to a couple of schools. So I wanted to be a dentist my whole life, so I'm excited. You know, knowing that someone is supporting your education and giving you the opportunity to finish your goals, it's not it's just someone supporting what you're doing. And as you look back on your life, you think of how important these contacts are. And to have a friend who is uh, so, uh, committed to everything she does. I mean, what better friend can you have?